Dear beloved, we are gathered together in the sight of God and these assembled witnesses to join this man and this woman in holy matrimony, which is an honorable estate instituted by God and in signifying unto us the mystical union which exists between Christ and his church. Instead, they are a covenant made today between each of you and God, indicating your love and undying devotion for each other for a lifetime. Blake, do you take Shelby to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness or in health, in life's joys and life's disappointments? Remaining ever faithful to your wife until death do you part. I do. Shelby, do you take Blake to be your lawfully wedded husband? To have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or in poor, in sickness or in health, in life's joys and life's disappointments. Remaining ever faithful to your husband until death do you part. I do. This one. I thee wed. I thee wed. With all my worldly goods. With all my worldly goods. To the end out. To the end out. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. I give this ring. To my beloved. To my beloved. As a token of my love. As a token of my love. Now and forever. Now and forever. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. By the authority vested in me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, and in accordance with the vows you have taken each to the other, and by virtue of the laws of the state of South Carolina, I joyfully pronounce you husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man ever put asunder. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. You may kiss the rock. I now present to you Mr. and Mrs. Blake Ellis.
I just want to say, like, all jokes aside, genuinely, like, I'm super proud of you. And, like, and I'm super proud of Shelby. And you you love her so much, and I know she loves you so much back. And um, I think y'all are just so awesome together. And I know that God's got some awesome plans in store for y'all. And um, I just want to say that I love you guys both. Welcome to the family. And uh, it's going to be awesome. <laughs> Shelby, you've proven to me that patience is the key to happiness, and if one day I can be as happy as you, then that's going to be good for me. <laughs> um, Blake, because of you, I know that my best friend is always going to be happy, safe, and most importantly, loved and cherished. <laughs> I love you both. Uh, one of the things that uh, David had actually said whenever uh, he was describing uh, Blake's face when Shelby was walking down the aisle was almost like um, he couldn't he couldn't wait for her to get there to get to him. He was he just wanted her to hurry up and be there, and uh, I think that that really sums up how how amazing he feels about her and how uh, awesome they are together. And I really welcome you to the family. And I think you guys are going to do great, and I'm really excited to see what happens. Where God puts us when we take advantage of it. And I thank God for my little girl. And I thank God for Blake. Because I truly believe that God put Blake here for Shelby. And I want to welcome Blake to our family. Gentle Blake. <laughs> 